Hi, good evening, everyone. Thank you for coming. I'm Tom Kotick. Tomasz Kotick in Czech, but Tom Kotick here in the States. Um, this is, a, I make sculpture. Let's just go with a little background, quick background. I'm an artist, visual artist, but I also play music, which will be the major theme of my very quick talk here. Uh, and I also curate shows and um, I make sculpture primarily and graphic works too, which are hanging over there on the wall. Um, this is a piece um, that was used in the uh, card for the uh, presentation tonight. Thank you, Susanna, for thinking about this piece. Um, and it's, uh, I, I guess I'm gonna go non-linear. I'm gonna go with this piece, which is a rather old piece from 2005, but it was one of the first music pieces that I did. Um, I've been playing uh, music since I was a kid. And um, in the last 10, 15 years, my work has really focused on how to visualize music or different ways of visualizing music. Um, this is uh, from uh, a concert I had recently in Prague with a band that I play with called Strzeszewicka Kramla. And um, I'm hoping to bring them to the States for a show, so stay tuned. Um, but my, um, as I say, uh, my real um, uh, force or, or my driving force is trying to visualize music. and. Um, I started from playing in bands and so on to taking a, a very literal approach to music in my work, which involved um, putting music in the work. Um, this is a piece called Rational Impulse from 2004, 2005 again, same period as the other piece. As you can see, there's a stereo that leads to a box that I had soundproofed. Uh, the um, sort of a Pandora's box idea, the, the, the music inside the box was playing a band that I was playing with at the time called Mighty High, which was a heavy metal band. And uh, when you had the lids closed on the box, the music was very contained, but you would open the box and the music would blast out at you. Um, sort of uh, with the idea that music is in all of us. And so when you find ways to release your inner music, anything can happen. So that was the, uh, the idea behind this piece. I did another version of this piece at Meat Factory in Prague in 2014. I revisited this idea years later. Again, this very large object, sort of quiet space. You open it up and bam, music's blasting out at you. Again, with another band I was playing with at the time, so the music is biographical. The music becomes a biographical aspect to the visual which is also biographical as it's made by my hand. Um, so in these works, I was really using music as, as part of the um, pieces, but I've also thought about how can I talk about music without having music, about it without it. And so I have started um, a few years later with taking the forms, what I call the architecture of sound, the forms from music, speakers, amplifiers, guitars, and blending those into sculptures. So this is a form based on an Ampeg bass amplifier, which is a very iconic bass amplifier, which I play. Again, I'm using here um, soundproofing materials, wood, felt, things that are used in actual amplifiers and speakers and things, sort of the architecture of sound and architecture of silence, because these are also used to um, contain sound and shape sound. So I was using these forms and these shapes in my work for a while, but Recently, I've really been thinking about how, again, um, how I can get away from being so literal. This is, again, using the, the shapes, the architecture of sound. But in more recent work, I've been thinking how I can be even less literal and think about music in a poetic way, how I can think about co composing visually as you would compose musically. So um, this is called rhythm and melody. Really, it's not... Uh, uh, how to say. It's not a uh, literal translation of music, but a, a more imaginative um, take on how to create and compose uh, visually and musically. So I think of these shapes as floating in space to a soundtrack, to your own soundtrack. Bring the soundtrack to the shapes, to the colors, to the forms. Again, shape floating through space in a composition. Comp composition, a word used both visually and in music. 
Um, this is a piece I did actually in Brno at the House of Arts. Um, the idea here is that I was creating a rhythm in the room as you create a rhythm musically. And, you ent and the architecture of the space becomes an instrument that you are, uh, are you know, enveloped into. That's a detail. And this is my latest project, a mural that I was just showing in Prague at SPZ Gallery. Again, an idea, a musical idea without the music. You bring your composition to it. And that's a detail of the form. Thank you. <laughs>